That's, she walked out, by right. the looks of it. I'm you? guessing over the night. The door was wide open. I felt chilly. Came down and saw a bunch of foot, a foot set of footprints. One by one. <laughs> and I uh, found a footprint going out into the, the woods. Shit. Hmm. So, I don't know, <laughs> do we want to go looking for her? Did she take things? Or? No, she just packed up and left. What did she pack up? She didn't really come with much. Yeah, she just took what she had and probably took a can of peaches or some other stuff. Yeah, peaches. Yeah. <laughs> I think that was the last can, too. Fuck. <laughs> You're like Tallahassee and his Twinkies. <laughs> you look out, bad boy. I don't know how close you were to her, but I was just wondering <laughs> if you were that concerned or anything about uh, party. I mean, no, party members are nice, but... <laughs> and, uh... Last male to be? And, uh... You, you, uh there's a stirring. There's a stirring in the sleeping bag. And, uh, Mason, his eyes sort of open from a dreary and dank coma. Three adventurers travel through tales untold. Will they survive? Starring... Ryan! Nick! Nathan, this is Dungeons and Dragons. Yeah. So you. So I'm close by to him. Yeah. I right. smack him. <laughs> Finally. <laughs> All right. You wake up with a really red cheek. <laughs> yeah. You're, you're like and oh, one more oh. step. <laughs> and uh, you're extremely hungry and you're parched. It's so parched. <laughs> you you attempt to funnel food into your mouth, but water. keep messing with the stub ass. <laughs> and uh, he's calling for water. Hank, he's like, quickly grabs a glass of water in. <laughs> and this is a face you don't recognize. You're in a place you don't recognize. What the fuck? <laughs> Who the then, fuck are you? Just, you just, 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 just remember. You realize. <laughs> yeah. all, all, all I can picture now is him giving you a glass of water. You reach with your stump. Yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> fuck you! <laughs> Who the fuck are you? What? Well, my name is Hank. That, that's, well, you know him. That's Vance. Is he with me? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'm at too healthy meal. <laughs> Who the fuck are you? What? Hank? What? Where are we? Do you guys care to explain? I don't think a stranger should be telling uh, one of your, your... Fans! Explain. Shit happened. <laughs> Who died? What? Where did I go? <laughs> Show it a list. Who didn't die? Uh, <laughs> it's easier that way. So it's me, me. Him. Yeah, him. The other guy. You. There's Hank. And what's his face? Alf. Alf. Yeah. That's who's left. <laughs> and Alf waves his stump. Hey, stump bros. Stump bros. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna get up. I'm gonna go left hook Paul. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, how much does he remember? I don't remember you. You remember up to the point over. where he got his arm cut off. Oh, you're uh, like after that. You're at full health. Full health? Yeah. Am I? Yes. Okay. Cool. Got a little sleep. Yeah. Call my heels in a little. Yeah. Okay. Well, I'm gonna go right, left hook him since I'm over right. <laughs> yeah. So you're just gonna slug him. Yeah. Ten. Yeah. The old one d four. Four. Yes. Yeah, so you get slugged. Lose four, four health. I'm just gonna like.
So you sort of got a busted jaw. Like you're 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 mad. Ah. Yeah. Pussy. So Hank's like, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, well. Okay. I did. Hank, Hank, Hank. I'm good now. He, Food. He, he deserved it. I did. Passed. <laughs> okay. And, you, uh, you see the stump? Food. That was him. I he deserves it. Football cops can't do that. So anyway. I'll go prepare a meal. Uh, I guess you should fill him in know. on what happened. Sure. Yeah. Should happen. So that's all they tell you is shit happened. Yeah. So, yeah. Depends on how inquisitive you are on wondering what happened. And, uh, so he's preparing you a little meal. <laughs> of doom. Why'd you hurt a lot? Kind of go back down in the basement. Take spot stretcher because we don't need this anymore. <laughs> so uh, Alf goes up to you since these jackasses yeah, won't tell you anything. Uh, so, a lot of shit happened while you were out in La La Land. You lost your arm. Remember that? Yeah. Uh, so what happened after that? Oh, jeez. Who was it? Did we Carter, tried, Car yeah. What did Carter do after he chopped off my arm? Uh, well, nothing really. He left after that. Because I mean, he made up his choice. And then, I mean, I don't really remember. Because he's unconscious yeah. now, too. He, I, actually I mean, didn't, yeah. he actually didn't really see Carter leave. He doesn't know what yeah. happened after. Yeah, that's true, technically. He, he actually doesn't even know that his arm got yeah. cut off. <laughs> well, he yeah. knows that the yeah. arm part, but... I know, but like, he yeah. passed out then the cut off, so he doesn't know what Carter yeah. did after that. So. And uh, we tried to escape, and then Mike and Jane got killed by Carver, and then I think Carver got like snagged by a, a zombie. Chris was disappeared. Yeah, the kid disappeared. Where do you go? Don't know. Got lost in the blizzard. And then... We're too busy hauling your ass. <laughs> yeah. Where'd Shaniqua go? Who? Sarita? 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 Okay. How did she fucked <laughs> off today? She left last night. Left last night. Well, this morning. I mean, Hank suggested we possibly go look for her or something. I don't know. I'm a little concerned why Sarita would leave. I guess I'm down in the basement right now. Okay. Looking at the stretcher, taking it apart. Yeah. Don't really want to. I know. I know it can be important in the future, but don't really want to carry it around necessarily. I'm, instead, I'm gonna like take the stuff that I would have used for the stretcher and make bandages out of it, like makeshift bandages. Yeah. Mm, okay. Stock. And uh. So. So Hank goes back into the the room. Uh, are you guys? I'm guessing you guys aren't looking for Sarita. I'm in the basement. I, I mean, she didn't do much. We don't really know her. If she comes back, she'll be back. Yeah. Oh, okay. And, uh, he knows you that you're in the basement, and he yells, Hey, uh, Vance, could you, uh... What? Stay out of the basement. Why? I don't think it's really necessary for you to go down there anymore. Your friend's awake. You can just take all the medical stuff up here. I gotta do my job. You need any help with your job? Nah, I prefer it alone. Okay. He totally waves the bodies. <laughs> <laughs> Sarita's totally down though. <laughs> well, you're in the basement. Spot check. If you if you assume some foul play, investigate. No, he told me to get out. If I if I look around, I'm gonna get shot. <laughs> shot? He has no weapons. That I know Never of. Yeah. <laughs> Who's an RPG? <laughs> <laughs> Very suspicious of the man who saves, who has fed and clothed you. You didn't cloth me. Can't yeah. us. Yeah. And uh, okay. Twenty. I'm doing my best not to get poisoned <laughs> by him. <laughs> I'm not exactly on the trusting side of them. Yeah. <clears throat> All right. And so uh. Yeah, so pretty much the, the day goes by, you guys sort of, you get a feel for what occurred, bad things happened, uh, there was a blizzard, and just a lot of sketchy things, and, yeah, so what do you guys, what would you guys like to do around the house, before dinner time there? I'd like to make a, another medical station. Okay, yeah, he just says, don't, make sure it's not in the basement. Okay. All right. I'm gonna ask Hank if I can look around. 
Yeah, just don't go around the basement. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You're really keen about us not going in that basement. Yeah, I don't like it when people are really rummaging around through my, you know, my stuff down there. Fair. Mm -hmm. oh, he's attack on Titan right now. <laughs> and uh, yeah, so he's chopping up some veggies and stuff. Some canned goods. Some canned through them. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, can I search the place? Okay, so he's he's in the kitchen just doing what he's doing. So is it a, is it a church or is it? Like uh, you don't perceive it as a church. It's just it's a nice home. Nice home. So it's been sort of converted into a funeral home. With pews, because they're all pews. In. No, there's no pews here. It's a pew. It's a home. Yeah, it's a very nice looking home. That's sort of so like. It's not a like few of them do the pews, because they have like the little spot yeah. where they have like the top and then the pews. There isn't really no pews. It's there, just so chairs. Yeah, it's just chairs. Okay. Yeah, in the piano room, which is usually where the ceremony takes place. Yeah. You carry the casket upstairs. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. So what's downstairs? Do I swatch out the shit or what? Sure, you're gonna go to the basement? Not to the basement. Oh. The first floor. Oh, first floor? That's what he means by downstairs. First floor, oh. first floor uh, contains the kitchen and, uh, like, the kitchen dining room and the lounge room. And then a staircase to the second floor. And a door to the basement. I'm gonna go up to the second floor. <clears throat> okay. Yeah. And look around the second floor. Okay. And, uh, you see four rooms. There's this big room with a piano and, uh... A bunch of chairs, usually where the ceremony takes place. Uh, a bathroom, two bedrooms. One is the guest room, and one is Hank's room. Okay. And uh, what would you like to do, Vance? I'm setting up my, setting up my medical station. Okay, and how about you, Paul? Uh, Sitting in the fire. Okay. Don't sit too close to that fire. So, uh... <clears throat> Alf, Alf is also sitting by the fire. Armistice? He looks at you. <laughs> he, flashes, Alf, dude. he flashes the stump. He says, Definitely. I won't forget this. And he looks at your bruised jaw. He's like, I, I said, by the looks of it, I don't think you're going to forget this for a while either. Probably not. <laughs> Real one. And then Vance is just on the corner, and I won't forget this. Points to where he got hit by him. Yeah. No, nothing left over. It's perfectly fine yeah. now, but. But, uh, yeah. So he says, I definitely cannot forgive you for what you did to us. And, uh, yeah. So as, uh, dinner occurs, you guys are fed and big full bellies. And, uh, it's cleaning up. The night proceeds onwards. Uh, let's see. Okay. Did anybody close the door or just left it open? No, no, it was okay. <laughs> I'm hoping. <Yeah>. Uh, <clears throat> Wind blows in, blows like in fire. I'd a, uh, a roll, a d20. Six. Okay. Plus <laughs> wisdom. Is it perception? Nope. Just, uh... Yeah, let, me, let me see your stats here. Oh, you were cursed. Wa will you be waking up whenever he tries to kidnap you <laughs> and take you to the basement? <laughs> and, uh... Yeah. So you guys wake up. And... Paul is not in the room. Yeah. So, we got two almost dudes and me. <laughs> and uh, uh, Hank is in the kitchen just preparing breakfast. Is there any meat at this breakfast by chance? No, no meat. Although well, you can't gone. ask. And uh, so uh, Mason and uh, Vance and Alf, you guys uh, wake up and you realize, huh, although he's can't forgive him, but it is slightly curious that two people disappear in two nights. Another one bites the dust. Mm. <laughs> and, uh, so yeah, what do you guys do? Wait for my death. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what do you do, Mason? Where's Bull? And, uh, he's in the... He, he's in the, the kitchen preparing some, like, cereal and stuff. He's like, Paul? 
think he ran away too. <laughs> <laughs> oh fuck. <laughs> I mean, he could He's still be in the... Yeah. I mean, he might be in the, uh... The upstairs bedroom, possibly. I don't know. Haven't seen him yet today. <laughs> I'm gonna see what Alf and... In there. Alf? Yeah. Alright, you go up to Alf. No, I'm gonna see what Alf does. Like, how Alf oh. responds. Uh, I'm Alf... investigate. Okay. Because I have three plus investigation. <laughs> I, where are you investigating? I'm gonna go investigate upstairs. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Investigate something. I don't know. Where? Uh, the store rooms. For him upstairs. Okay. Uh, he's not upstairs. He's not upstairs. No. I'm gonna go into Hank's room. Hank's room. Okay. Shit! I'm gonna search his room. Sure. Yep. I plus three search. So eleven. Eleven. Uh. So as you're rummaging around his room, you see a bunch of, like, uh, sort of religious symbols and, like, a picture frame that had presumably, possibly, his spouse. And, uh, no children in the pictures. And, uh, got a lot of clothes, a lot of the same colors, you know, very, very singular outfits. But you also find, uh, a, a bottle and a syringe beside it. <laughs> <laughs> so that was a con check. I'm gonna destroy the syringe. Okay. Smash. So you um, break the syringe. Chug the bottle for sure. <laughs> um, I'm gonna take the bottle down. I'm gonna take the bottle and put it in my pocket. Okay. What do you do, Vance? I'm gonna sit next to Alf and just watch him. <laughs> okay, Alf is also doing nothing. He's just like. 20 bucks says that the syringe thing is like his cancer medicine. <laughs> 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 and uh so as Hank prepares his breakfast like so will you guys be having breakfast I'm just, I'm just looking at Alf what I'm just looking at Alf okay and uh, Alf is like quit staring at me man you're <laughs> creeping me out a little bit I'm staring at it. <laughs> <laughs> just a thousand yards stare. Like yeah. he moves his head, he just looks past him. <laughs> Man, you're creepy. He he goes to the other side of the room. This is the, looking at the spot that he was. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, he goes to the other side of the room and just chills out. But then he's like, uh, oh, I don't like the basement. And then uh he doesn't know what to do. He's like, ah! <laughs> <laughs> And, uh, Actually, yeah. there's one arm over his head, <laughs> just dumb trying. We're gonna come back downstairs and, like, ask... What's his name? Hank? Hank? Yeah. I'm like, he wasn't upstairs. No? Huh. Did he pack up and leave? Sounds like something this guy would do. He wouldn't pack up and leave. He stayed after getting all our arms cut off. Yeah. So we'd probably kill him. Surprised you haven't done that. <laughs> Pose your bottle shows that is huh. So, uh, care for some breakfast? I guess so. I'm gonna pull. Gives you a bowl and a spoon. It's like some old, co old, uh, cornflakes. <laughs> After we eat breakfast, I'm gonna pull and side. Okay, so you pull them aside. Still a thousand yards. Pull them aside to a private conversation. Okay. I'm going to show him the bottle. See if we know what it is. Roll intelligence on pharmaceuticals. I ain't good at pharmaceuticals. There you go. You could have inspected that yourself. Yeah. He's eight, though. Only four. For craft pharmaceuticals, though. Oh. I have... <laughs> oh, well, life sciences of five. Okay. Life science? Maybe. Well, it's an 18, so what do you modify? Do you want, do you want a plus 5, plus 8, plus 13? So, uh, you, uh, you know, you sort of know this as a traditional uh, toxin uh, that uh, immobilizes whoever consumes it. Not cancer medicine. <laughs> <laughs> no. Yeah. And uh, Hank sort of notices you guys pulled aside. Is there uh, anything you guys are wondering about? No, just wondering when the buzzer ends. What's for breakfast? 
Oh, the, well, the cornflakes. Kellogg's. Tony the Tiger. It's the, probably the last box we'll ever have. They're great. Shut them in the basement. <laughs> <laughs> the uh, blizzard ended probably about yeah. probably the night, the, the morning you woke up that night. Yeah. Hmm. So it'll be even easier for your friend to leave. No blizzard. <laughs> yeah. Sit on the couch. Okay. Mm. Do some self-loving. Mm. Hank uh, watches, watches you guys. He sits also in the lounge room, chair by the uh, basement door. It's just sort of, yeah. maybe doing some crochet or something. But uh, he's keeping an eye on you. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Elf goes in the kitchen to like rummage at the cupboards, like, ooh, lucky charms. <laughs> like, yeah. Score! Yeah. Oh, full eyes? Yeah, nah. score eyes. Yeah, so uh, what do you guys do? I'm gonna be going in the kitchen. Okay. Uh, is there any spoons there? Uh, maybe not out, but you can open up a drawer to get a spoon, probably. Okay, I'm gonna search for a knife. Okay. Let's do a spot check. In the excuse of looking for a spoon. Uh, total of 19. Yep, you easily find a knife in the sink. Used to, to chop up some veggies last night. Okay. It's like a sort of like a Jamie Oliver worthy <laughs> cutting like knife. A couple other doors to look for more knives. Just okay. Yeah, you you find some other like a paring knife. Like I, just, I just want to know where possible weapons are at. If he okay. grabs that one, I want a backup. <laughs> all, right. uh, all the knives are kept in one drawer, along with the other utensils. Yeah. So there's like a big uh, cleaver for like you know, carving meat and. Big knife and a small paring knife. Yeah, there's a couple knives. Yep. And you currently wield one? You got any chicken? Like, meat? Huh. Besides that canned chicken I gave you guys the other night. We got any more? Uh, I don't know. You could search the cupboards if you're really looking for some canned chicken. Maybe we'll search for some canned chicken. Okay. You open up the cupboard with uh, the cans. Uh, it doesn't it, it appears he probably used up the last of his canned chicken the other night when he fed all of you. What do you have with veggies? Uh, nothing fresh, obviously. I uh, got some canned, uh, probably some canned beans, maybe carrots, some mushrooms, lots of mushrooms. No one eats those things. I'm gonna get some mushrooms. Okay. So you get some mushrooms. Got any eggs? Nope. Spend my time cutting up some mushrooms. Okay, yeah, some canned shrooms. <laughs> looking for an excuse to keep the knife on him. Oh, okay. looking too suspicious. Yeah. He also, he can't see you. He's in the lounge. I don't know, but if he ever walks in, just yeah. sees me with a knife in my hand. Cause yeah. Okay. I'm busy. Yep. And uh, how about you, Mason? You're in the same room. Alf is just sort of... Is he still in the kitchen with me? Yes, yeah. So what did you do before with all of this? All this? You used to run this place. Uh... You know, there's a funeral home, right? Small services. This is the graveyard, after all. And, uh... Yeah, South, South Town Graveyard. And, uh... Yeah, so... I just... Do what funeral directors do. Prepare the bodies, bury them, give some ceremonies. You want this place never been raided? Nope. It's pretty reclusive. I don't know how you guys ended up finding it. Suppose the blizzard does wonders for you when you're wa wandering through a forest. Mm -hmm. Ooh, family. Family? Oh, had a wife. Had? Huh? Yeah. Died two years before this. The flu took her. Weak immune system. Yep. <clears throat> How about you? No family. No? Everyone's got a family at some point. Parents. Yeah. Picture. Don't you even know what happened to them? No. Do you ever regret that? No. <laughs> Why is that? Dead beats. Mm -hmm. Real shame, eh? Dude, it looks like you turned out well. You fought with me? <laughs> <laughs> what did you do? The winks. <laughs> Male strange. Uh. Well, 
Went to universities, studied, a lot of science. Hmm. Definitely turned out well then, especially with those deadbeat parents. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You got some similarities. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, yeah, so you guys, uh, any, any other questions for Hank? I'm going to get up and go to the kitchen as well. Okay. Everyone's <laughs> <laughs> cooking in the kitchen with la. Alright, so uh, you guys uh, are in the kitchen together now. Just saying to myself, cooking in the kitchen with la. I'm going to search for any weapons. Alright, <laughs> also, well. get you to roll a d20. Hmm? I'm going to search for... 15. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to search for weapons or knives, basically. Okay. Uh, go for it. Just making a mushroom stew. 19. Yep, uh, you, you open up the drawer, there's like all the, where all the knives are kept. Uh, there's like a, I don't know, it's like a mallet, like one of those uh, tenderizer mallets. Mm -hmm. Stuff like that. Basic utensils that could have, pretty much anything can be used as a weapon, really, a wooden spoon. Yeah. Yeah, just think of uh, basic kitchen utensils and that'll probably be there. Mm -hmm. 